Let's use integral calculus to find the area under the curve y equals x plus a half. According to the fundamental theorem of calculus, the integral from 0 to n of x plus a half dx is equal to the quantity x squared over 2 plus x over 2 evaluated at n and 0. When we plug in n and 0 and subtract, we get n squared over 2 plus n over 2 for the integral. On the other hand, we can also compute this integral by breaking up the region into a bunch of different pieces like this. Each of the pieces will then be the definite integral from i minus 1 to i under the function x plus a half. So we can add up all of these integrals according to properties of integrals. Once we do this, we again get that each integral is x squared over 2 plus x over 2 evaluated at the endpoints, and thus we get that the integral in question is given by the sum from i equals 1 to n of i. But now that we've computed the definite integral in two separate ways, we see that the sum of the first n positive integers is equal to n squared over 2 plus n over 2.